السلام علیکم ہائی گائز ویلکم بیک ٹو مائی چینل ریڈیالوجی فنڈامنٹلس آئی ایم انجیلا شفات اینڈ یو آر واچنگ دا فرسٹ ویڈیو لیکچر آف مائی چینل اف یو وانٹ ٹو بلڈ یور نالج ان ریڈیالوجی اینڈ ریڈیو امیجنگ ٹیکنالوجی ہٹ دا ریڈ سبسکرائب بٹن اینڈ دا بیل آئیکن ٹو واچ مائی نیکسٹ لیکچرس فار اینی کیوریز کوشچنس اور کنفیوژنس یو کین کمنٹ ان اے کمنٹ سیشن اور ڈیم آن مائی انسٹاگرام آئی ڈی مینشن ان دا ڈسکرپشن آف ویڈیو I am going to share the notes of the lectures too. So for that, you can tell me on my Instagram ID. Let's start our first lecture, Basic Introduction to Radiology. Moving towards the basic term in radiology, which is obviously itself radiology. It should be known to each and every student of radiology and also for those students who are planning about pursuing degree in radiology. I have mentioned a very very simple definition of radiology which is the study and application of the imaging technology used to diagnose and treat disease with the help of radiations it simply means the branch in which we study or use imaging technology imaging here means visualizing so here in radiology we visualize human body through what through technology machine all right we use two important things in radiology keep it in your mind the two things are imaging technology and radiations all right when these two when these two imaging technology and radiation combine they help us to diagnose to detect or to find abnormalities diagnose means to detect or to find abnormalities so it helps us to diagnose and to treat disease with the help of radiations we can treat those diseases with the help of two basic things in radiology one is imaging technology and other is radiation so the basic thing in the radiology are imaging technology and radiations example for diagnosing the disease in human body are x-ray ct scan mri and uh, ultrasound and much more so these modalities we are going to discuss in a later next videos now if you talk about the treatment disease we you might be knowing about that it's a radiotherapy we use radiotherapy as a um, basic tool for treating the diseases by passing the radiations into the body and those diseases can be tumors or cancer now let's move towards the radiation which is the other second important term in radiology as i already told you in radiology two important uh, things are there one is imaging technology and other is radiation imaging technology will be we will be discussing them later on in the next videos uh firstly the basic physics should be known that is radiation so let's move towards the basic mm, term that is radiation radiation is nothing but a form of energy like light if we talk of light that's also a form of energy same is the case with radiation it's also a form of energy which is in motion moving here and there and it gets discharged from an object i can say it comes out from an object where from it originates or generates from that it gets discharged and either it spreads out we can say it gets scattered or it gets absorbed taken in by the other object in the space okay coming to the next sub topic that is types of radiation it's very important for us to discuss the types of radiation as we have to get to know the radiation which type of radiation we use in radiology so that's why we are going to come towards this sub topic in general to know the types of radiations there are two types of radiations one is a particulate radiation and another is electromagnetic radiations when we talk about particulate radiation in here here this radiation has energy which has got the charge at the proton neutron or it can be electron you might be knowing about the 
proton, neutron and electron. Proton means positive charge, neutron means neutral and electron means negative charge. So here in particulate radiation, there is a charge in the energy that can be proton, neutron or it can be electron. Now moving towards the second uh, type of radiation that is electromagnetic radiation but first make sure that particulate radiation is not used in radiology all right when we talk about electromagnetic radiation emr it's a short form of electromagnetic radiation emr it's a form of energy that is in also in motion and it does not have mass means in this form of a radiation the energy has got no mass means no weight and it has got no charge means it's charge less as compared to particulate radiation they have got charge at a proton neutron or electron but in electromagnetic it has not got any kind of a charge it's chargeless and it can travel means propagate either as a wave or it can act as a discrete particle of energy like the light it that also behaves like a wave or a discrete particle which is uh, individual particle all right like an individual particle of energy and that particle is ca called as photons what is it called photons or we can call it quanta photons will be discussed later on in the next video but you should be knowing that light is also made of photon so in the case of electromagnetic radiations they are also made of photons now example of electromagnetic radiation is x-ray which we are going to discuss in the whole subject and the x-ray is the basic of radiology make it very clear that whenever you are asked what is the basic of radiology it is x-ray okay from this we can from x-ray we can diagnose treat diseases in the human body now another example is gamma rays that's also used it in radiology to discussing we are going to discuss them later on visible light which is around us and microwaves radio waves all right so this was all about radiology basic introduction to radiology radiation and types of radiations my next video will be on x rays and the deep brief info of x ray and their properties thank you for watching Take care.